What is up guys and gals? We are here at the Cackleberry Campground. We got in this morning, we got checked in. Uh, there was uh, quite the fiasco going on with that, but we got in, we got settled. Now we are out here in the campground kind of exploring. I want to do a quick walk around, show you what's going on here. Uh, try to avoid some of the music that's going on because there is a bunch of music, but I uh, just wanted to give you a quick walk around of what's going on, all right? So let's turn the camera around and I will show you guys what's up. They've got a little wall of death show going on over here. Bunch of people up there watching that. It's noisy here, so you might not be able to hear me. that music I'm gonna try to get by that real quick anybody they got cornhole going on over here Potties over here. What's up? Porta potty crew in the house. <laughs> better parties in the porta potty. Sell some stuff over here. Hey, what's up? Hello. How's it going? IVRV. Oh, that's to get some like IV to recover from your hangover. Oh, look, it's Bobby V. I don't buy cheap leathers, bro. I got a guy. That's right, Legendary USA. All day, baby. Oh, look. It's the Bonnie Princess. What? What? She's mad at me. She's mad at me. You got what? Buy, buy some stocking. So a bunch of stuff over here. I don't even know if you guys can hear me, but a bunch of stuff for sale here is the band area and the bar, a bar of many, one of many. sitting out here in the middle they do have a good amount of bars so when it gets busy at night it looks like it shouldn't be too big of an issue different vendors out here 
Last time we were here for the Biketoberfest, wasn't even half as many actual vendors. Smoke heaven. Cacklin' Bob Beering in the house. Nothing here fits me. Absolutely nothing. I believe that. ATMs, in case you need some ducats. Food, a lot of food vendors here. Cigars. What's happening? Things to buy. Oh, the old sex swings. I'm sure they'll pitch them as camping chairs, but come on. Some candles. Candles. All right, getting over here to this other side. There's a lot of stuff over here, so bear with me. There's a lot of walking, too. As you can see over here, all the food vendors, Brazilian bowls, Philly cheesesteaks, some sort of grill, nachos, sodas. We ate down there at Papa's Barbecue. We had some loaded nachos and some loaded mac and cheese. A couple more after that, but we came from down there just now, so. carry handbags jewelry some more jewelry over here never get never a shortage of uh, jewelry at bike rallies Helmets. Can always get some helmets. More jewelry. Gonna pretend I didn't see the guy with the blue beard. Because that was weird. More jewelry, sunglasses, t-shirts for women, bandanas, all that good jazz. This looks like a knife siller. It's happening. Selling some nice knives. Highway Vixen, you guys might have seen her. What's happening? Highway Vixen selling her bandanas. I've not actually formally met Highway Vixen, but I've seen some of her stuff on the YouTubes. Some scantily clad young ladies. Plenty of those here. Some more bike gear, flannels, gloves, boots, bags for your bike. You know, the usual rally wears, vet shirts, t shirts, tank tops. All that good jazz, some, some Donald J. Trump. What? More t-shirts. And another bar over here for later when it gets busy. 
and the bands are playing over here. Plenty of bar space. Big Gib in the house. On, What's man? happening, man? When'd you get here? This morning, about 11 a.m. It's another Jersey guy. Yeah. Rode in today, got here this morning. Left last night, right? Uh, I did uh, like 700 miles yesterday. Started at four. Uh, yeah. Tried to wait till the rain, got a little light. Gotcha. Stopped in South Carolina, slept for two hours, and then got up and did 360 more miles. Very nice. Yeah. Let me wrap this video up so I can talk to you. Gotcha. All right, guys. So. That's just a real quick walk around of what they got going on here at the Cackleberry if you stay here or if you come by to see music or whatever. We're staying here, but we're going to be getting out and about all week. So my plan is to go ahead and do walk arounds everywhere I go, kind of show you guys what's going on, try to get them uploaded to you right away as opposed to waiting until I get home and making a video and all that bull crap. So they're going to be kind of unedited and raw, a lot like they were in Laconia this year when we went, or this last year when we went. So that's kind of my plan for the week. I got uh, five more days here, so we're going to be hitting all the main spots, all the cool spots. Uh, Destination Daytona, the um, Speedway, a bunch of the different bars that have things going on. And I will try to record all of that and get that up to you guys as quick as possible. So that was a quick walk around here today. And uh, we're going to go have some drinks now. I'm going to talk to Big Gift from Jersey. I'm going to probably meet up with some other folks that are going to be here. A lot of people we know are staying here, so we're going to be hanging out tonight having a good time. So. Thank you guys for watching that again, just a quick walk around of the Cackleberry campground and uh, yeah, that's it. But a good time, man. If you guys want to stay here, make sure you book early uh, in the year, get your reservation, get a confirmation number or some sort of reservation number. Cause we had a little bit of a problem with that. So make sure you're booked and you have some sort of proof of your booking and uh, you shouldn't have any problems. Other than that, it's great. All right, guys, thanks for watching. If you haven't already hit that thumbs up button, if you haven't subscribed, give it a like, leave a comment, tell us what you think, tell us if you've been to Daytona, what your best, your favorite things about Daytona are, what you hate about Daytona, whatever, leave us a comment, and uh, we'll see you on the next one. All right, later.